I found love on a two-way street And lost it on a lonely highway I found love on a two-way street And lost it on a lonely That was a little Stacy Ladisov. I'm gonna start greeting y'all with a nice song. <clears throat> oh Lord. Mm. So I've been told. Hi, welcome back. That's why I need me a mate. So I could just be singing to him. Baby, let me sing you this song real quick, show you how much I love you. <laughs> Baby, if you're singing or show me how much you love me, I know you don't love me. <laughs> Oh my God. With music softly playing. <laughs> Baby. Let me warn you. It would not be good. It would not be good at all if I had to prove my love by singing to you. But just know I'm singing from my heart. <laughs> Don't worry about the keys and the note and the pitches. That's not important, but it's coming from the bottom of my heart. <clears throat> Knew you ended that lie by accident. No, what happened was after a certain time, it cuts you off. So after like an hour and I think 15 minutes, it cuts you off. That's why I was like, oh, it's going to cut off. But I'm going to be up for a minute, shit. Because I have to get a lot of this shit done. <clears throat> so I guess I could go another round and chit-chat with y'all for a moment. It's 1030, almost here. I don't plan on going to bed till about 4 o'clock anyway. Do I have something to eat? Oh, yeah, I do have something to eat. So I have to do that. Oh, no, they showing a baby coming out this woman. Pussy? Oh, no, I don't want to see that. I seen that once before, and that didn't, that didn't do good at all in my stomach and eyeballs. Hey, Jim, what's going on, bitch? It is 10.23. I've seen the Olive Garden uh, app on my phone. And I kind of got distracted. 10. 10. Do they close at 11 or do they close at 10? They close at 10. Damn. I could have placed the order. Fuck. <clears throat> it's okay. I got some shit up in there I can eat. Kennedy Davenport fan page. Oh, And I just talked to my sister too. Hey, her fan page, people. Thanks for having a fan page of my sister. She deserves it. She's a really sweet person. 
Let me tell you what she did. She got off the plane, got in her rental car, went to the grocery store, came up the stairs, went right in the kitchen, and cooked us breakfast. And we ate. Love her. Love her. Her. Love her. So, yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to see you. Hey, you see her queen. What is that? Is that the University of Riverside? That sound like. Some type of hospital room, Jeff. They said, clear, 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 down. They were. Damn. Are you serious? Ooh. -wee. I knew they was going to have a lot of views. Because that's all people were talking about was them supposed to get put out and they knew them hoes was going to cut up. And they did. Damn. I wonder how they would put their show on TV. It would have to go like on HBO Netflix or something like that because they can't you can't turn that down Meaning the way they be talking and how Kaya be going off and cussing and shit You can't turn that down It wouldn't be good if she can't say the cuss words and stuff But if Facebook is giving them a nice coin thotta you know, keep your ass on Facebook. Unless they can say, bitch, we're going to put y'all on something bigger and more. And pay y'all more. But like, a, I wouldn't be going against nobody like Mona Scott, though. I won't be going against no Mona Scott. I don't know what happened with them in Mona Scott, but baby, I won't be saying shit. I don't know what happened with them in Mona, but I'm gonna be cool with homegirl. She ain't did nothing to me, you know what I mean? Yeah, they went in on K Michelle. <laughs> Whew. I do know I don't want to be on that part but you know what the funny part was was the mama the mama had me dying laughing cause she kept looking back <laughs> They said tobacco chewing and spitting. <laughs> I don't like nobody lying on me. I'm a Christian, but now that was the funny part to me. The mama had me rolling. But that shit was funny. We need you, honey, to come to Argentina. Tell them to say it for me, just just smoke the blood. Okay, me too. Madison and Jasmine. Okay, that'll be hot. Maybe we could do something with Roll the Wonder. She come out here every blue moon. I'm sure we could knock a couple of things out the ballpark. 36 smoke. No, ma'am. Uh... <clears throat> Let's spark a joint, sis. I don't have no joint, sis. I just have blunt, sis. 
I can roll a joint, but I'll smoke a blunt gin. And you know what? I still have that edible too. I never, I'm scared of it. Oh, I'm so scared to eat that edible. Oh. Oh. I just don't want to eat it. Maybe I eat it tomorrow morning. Because I don't have anywhere to go. Since next time I come to Detroit, I'm going to roll your blunt, sis. All right. I was trying to make it to Detroit this weekend. But, baby, shit didn't go as planned as I wanted it to go. Especially if you got stuff to do. Yeah, I got stuff to do. Don't be scared of the edible. Take a little bit. Yeah. I could take little by little, but I don't know, baby. And no tea, no shade. I'm greedy. You know what I mean? I don't want to just eat half of the fucking cookie. I want to eat the whole fucking cookie. Shit. That like pinching off the edibles and shit. That, 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 that I don't want to pinch. I want to chew the motherfucker. I want to eat it. Like it's a regular fucking cookie. And it's not a regular fucking cookie. And my dumb ass brain don't think that. Because I want to glut up on everything. That's how I got so fucked up on that piece of cake I made. Because I had, the piece was too big and it was too much. So, I'm just like, ugh. Doing that half shit, ain't doing shit. And then I ate this whole motherfucker, and now I'm feeling tweaked the fuck out. So I don't know. I'm going to try to get it together <clears throat> tomorrow. I think I may have a little, some little things to do tomorrow. And then maybe after that, I'll just go ahead and chew it. Because I'll be home, so, you know, shit. I'll find something to do when I'm lit. Take my ass a quick little cold shower. Break it on down. Lay my ass down go to bed if it's too much. I wake up good enough. But I just don't want to go through all that shit again. Just being loaded. Yeah, I like Big Frida. I met Frida a couple of times. Yeah, why y'all on here licking like that? Nasty ass tongue. Everybody want Oprah to be president in 2020. I tell you this goddamn much. I know a lot of your asses is, go, is going to vote this time. Your parents, too, you all want to go through the shit we're going through now with King Orange up in there. I guarantee you, on that voting day, they're going to have a record-breaking of voters next time we can vote. I promise you, it's going to be a record breaking of how many people is going to go out there and vote for 2020. Whether the Oprah ass is signing up or not, they're going to vote for somebody else to get in there and
flip all that shit over. Because this shit is crazy. You know what I mean? <clears throat> Let's see our goal. Whether I do if I don't, I'm cool, Jeff. Oh no, Lunel, she got her ass naked. No, me um, Lunel. And I'm kind of mad because they brought out. Oh, he is. Whoa. I be wondering when I see like really nice looking men and women and they be single and they say they can't find a good person. I be thinking, is there something wrong with you? Because I don't know. I just be looking at some people like, baby, I will run home to be with you. But then I'm thinking, well, bitch, are you crazy? You know what I mean? Or what's wrong with you? Baby, I'm not here to drag you. I don't do all that. That, that that don't give me no enjoyment to do that. Now, I could block you, but me saying stuff about you, I don't even know you. I mean, what am I going to do? What, what is that going to do? Oh, I could drag you, as a matter of fact. You make sure you keep your young ass in school. How about that? And don't be too fast in the ass and in the balls to be having sex. And if your young ass is trying to have sex, which you better not be doing, you always use protection. I don't care how fine the person is. But you keep your ass in school and pay the fuck attention. And don't spend your time so much on these fucking social medias with these grown ass drag queens. Now how about that? Now I just dragged you. You happy now, Jeff? Dragged you and gave you some uh, education. You don't want to be gay and dumb. You're trying to prove points, not be dumbasses. Say no to drugs. Marijuana is herb. I said drugs. And live your fucking life, Judge. So that's a good drag for that ass. Now go to bed. <laughs> All good. Hey, drugs. I hate them too. That's why I'm smoking herb. Hate drugs. Be cautious on alcohol. But you too young to be talking about all that anyway. But I'm telling you, pay attention in school. There's a lot of shit right when you get out, all that shit gonna come right back in your face. And maybe before you even get out of school. A lot of times people can't find someone because a lot of people want to get with you but not be with you. Yeah, that's true. And I just be thinking, wouldn't you just want to have a person just like there all the time? I would feel. 
Like, why would you want to just bounce around? Don't don't they get tired or something? Don't you want somebody to just see all the time, do things with? It's like, damn, we just fucking. But then you just be lonely if you that type of person. I just don't be. I don't. I don't. I don't know. And I see so many people that are single. Baby, why are you single? All on the fucking apps. Everybody's single. Y'all working out, going to the gym, posting up these pictures, but y'all single. Why are you single? Like, I be thinking, there's something wrong with you? Because clearly you're not ugly. So you can find somebody, but why are you single? Then it's like everybody just fucking. What you doing? Just fucking. Okay. What you doing? Fucking. Like, okay. Everybody's just fucking. That's what they do. It's not relationships anymore. Everybody's just fucking. It's a fuck fest. And there's one person, all I have, baby. I have been single for 15 years, I think, if not 16. And when I tell you, it's at certain points, I'm like, whoo, I need to be in a relationship because I'm a very relationship type of person. But then I'm just like, ugh, I can't trust a motherfucker for shit because you can find Dick and ass, throat and pussy, before you could di- dial a fucking phone number. So I just be like, oh gosh. But you, I just don't find people who I feel like are just relationship material. And everybody, I, you know. Because I know a lot of people, and I know, you know, how they get down. I know what goes on. And I always ask, do you know these four people? And when they say yes, yes, yes to any one of them, baby, I already know something. It's something nasty with y'all. I can't have that. So my thing always been, I'm going to go outside of California, maybe, hopefully, or not hopefully, one day I'm going to find... Baby, Booyah, Cali, let's move. I always say that. My boyfriend is somewhere in another state just waiting on me, and I'm waiting on him. Let's move to Cali. Well, move your ass to Cali. Let's set it up and figure out how we're going to make this Money rise together. But we both got to bring in some money. Now, don't you know Shane Love Pink Lemonade? We good on my part. You, you could do this real quick. Make money, travel with me, and still you'll get your shit off the ground. Keep all this shit in the house. But you got to be sure you got to have some motherfucking, you got to have a job though. I can't have nobody that, who who don't have no working mentality and no go-getter type of mentality. Because I can't have nobody hold me back. I can't. I know Mariah's skinny. Baby, you said that 15 times. And I have repeated that. How many times do you want me to say it? She looks beautiful. You want me to say it again? Mariah Skinny. You know what? I think I ain't gonna run out of there. That's right, after you, for real. And now a lot of people, um, which I don't have a problem with dating someone who's vegan, 
but I just don't need nobody telling me what the fuck to eat or you shouldn't eat that. And baby, until the doctor tell me this is fucking with you, don't eat this. Then I'm not. Then I'm gonna. I ain't gonna stop until the doctor tell me. But I don't want nobody telling me, oh, you shit eating this and this. Is... No, I don't need you for that. Let me eat it until the doctor say, okay, now look. And then I'll be like, you know what? I'm good. But until then, no. The one guy was like, he don't, he don't fry chicken in his house and all this and all that. I'm like, well, ain't nobody got to fry no chicken in your house. Because I won't be cooking in that motherfucker anyway. If I can't cook me no fried wings, then I'm not, I don't want to be with you. How about that? But yeah, I was like, what the fuck? So now I just want to, you know, sit back, eat a pound, a pint of ice cream. Watch TV, smoke, and fall out. Shit, let's go somewhere tomorrow. We bored. It's simple, Jim. But you can't find nobody. It's hard to find people out here that mine is relationship goals. And not doing this two and three, three months shit. I don't like that type of shit. I can't do that. I can't, I can't work like that. I got to think long. I'm thinking long term. I'm thinking fucking forever. When I say we together, shit, we together. I ain't thinking about breaking up. And cheating on your ass. What the fuck? Any pageant soon? No. You know what I really thought about the pageant? I think I just wanted to do, like, the Continental and stuff. I don't think I ever wanted to be Miss Continental. I think I just wanted to have the experience of it. And I, I got the experience of it. And I had a good time doing it. And there's a, other, it's a couple other pageants that I have thought about doing just to, you know, have some fun with and, you know, get the experience of doing it and all that. But right now, I'm just thinking about saving my motherfucking money and trying to make some big-ass moves and getting ready for a pageant, winning or losing, ain't going to put the type of money that I'm trying to hold in my pocket in my pocket. And that's even if I win. Because I still got to put out more money because I got to travel and have New shit all the time. Nah, fuck that. I got some goals that I'm trying to do. And being in the pageant just ain't. It just ain't. And I was supposed to do a prelim to a pageant this weekend in Detroit. But I got ill, so I wasn't able to make it. <clears throat> Excuse me, but. I would have done it, and I would have been like, okay, cool, because that would have been a good pageant, you know, to do, and I still could have still got my judge. But it wasn't in the cards for me, so I had to go back to another, my first format. Bitch, you got goals that you're trying to do, and you're going to spend almost $10,000 or more for a pageant, and you're not going to win that when you win. You're not going to make that when you travel because you got to get outfits made to make sure you look good every time you go somewhere. So people won't talk about you. So you just in the fucking hole. And your dreams are set back for a fucking pageant. So my black ass ain't going to be doing any pageants anytime soon. And I'm good with it. Did you hear my drag come to Thailand? I did. I even shared it on my uh, page. I think it's amazing. I 
I just hope and pray, no tea, no shade, no pink lemonade, that it just keep going for about another 20 years, and they just be asking, you know me, oh, can you do this tour, can you do that tour, sure, 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 you know, make some money moves, until I own about two somethings, and I can say, no, nah, I'm just sitting my ass at home watching The Young and the Restless and Wendy Williams. Or I'm doing my own shit. Then I don't have to, you know, worry about performing. I can just hold the mic and just talk some shit real quick. And do that part. I don't know what it is about these motherfucking M&M's with the nuts. These have been amazing to me. And I've never been to m and eating with the mutt. I mean with the with the nuts. But I promise you, it's something that got my dish in order. I need to come back to more. Baby, go ahead and tell them to get me out there. Mm-mm. Harvey, I went to the store today to get some triple hoys. And forgot what the fuck I was going to go get. And I pulled up. Did think about it. So I ended up going to CVS and got some Alka-Seltzer. And. Still couldn't think of why the fuck I went up to the store. Came home, parked the car, turned the key. Fucking chip hoys. And that's how I ended up getting these. Because I didn't think, but I knew I needed something sweet. Because I didn't feel like making brownies or making a fucking cake. Oh, Reese's Pieces is, is, I don't like the little, the ones like the M&M's, those don't taste good. I do have a bag of Lay's up there, and I have plenty of bottles of hot sauce. I'm going to take those down too a little later. Mm-hmm. Fuck those right on up. I'm going to eat until <clears throat> I'm going to eat until I go to bed. I'm just going to fuck some shit up. Yeah, I always have a sweet tooth. I love candy. And I went to the dentist and they said my dentist said, you don't have one cavity. I just got to get a root canal. Don't tell me that, bitch. Because I'm about to fuck some candy. Ah! Not one cavity. Hmm. I've been fucking up sweets ever since. Ice cream. Oh, I don't like cheesecake. I don't do cheesecake, all that mushy shit. I don't like that shit in my mouth. I can't handle that. Franks. 
As a matter of fact, I was just eating some chips earlier before I put away the other bag of this damn Oh, you better go to the dentist with the hell and see what's going on. You eating orange sherbet, no ma'am. Mm-hmm. Girl, no cavities. The only thing I need to get done is a root canal. And it's been like two years. Or three years since I had like a gum cleaning. And that was it. But other than that, they said the mouth is wonderful. Mm hmm. Yeah, roll them dice. Blow. On that fork, let it go. Pick up the money. Would you travel to Thailand and took a pee? Oh, hell no. Hell fucking no. Mm-mm. No, ma'am. Mm-mm. No, ma'am. I would not travel there to compete again, no, ma'am. Ain't nobody got time for that. Uh-uh. I don't think my body is meant to be in tight ass. Yeah, I cracked it a long time ago. Yeah, I have some really good veneers. But the change price was hilarious. Baby, somebody had posted that. So, of course, I shared it. And somebody reported my shit. And people were saying they feel a certain type of way because they pussy. <laughs> because they pussies. Look like that. Well, baby, I'm sorry your pussy is leaning out. But apparently, that's what happened to pussies. Our balls be wrinkled. They look like prunes. You don't see us having a fit. And people are always posting us something with some all nasty looking balls. You mad because your pussy falling out? And I put some boys' assholes look like this. You know what I mean? They were just like, uh-uh. Baby, fuck that. My pussy. <laughs> My pussy look like this. <laughs> Somebody gonna rip this shit out. I'm sorry. But you know what I mean? And by this someone who has seen pussies. Some of them do look like that. She light skinned, her pussy just black. She dark skinned, her pussy just pink. <laughs> you know what I mean?
Every, pussies. Yeah. You can finally eat. Oh, girl, I know you happy. But wait. Poor pussies. Sore. Wet. Hot. Bald. Pussies. Just a friendly little cat. A friendly little cat. <laughs> I got to have my friend Jewel do that number again for me. All pussies are different. Just like all dicks are different. Titties are different. Asses are different. No. Poor pussies. Sore. Wet. Hot. Cold. Bald pussies. Just a friendly little cat. A friendly little cat. That's a song. I don't know who's singing it though. And every time my friend does it, I fall out. Because <laughs> to me, the lady is reading. And I kick his. I don't know who sing that song. Mm -mm. Just a friendly little cat. <laughs> song poor pussy for two for two on instagram girl falling out my mama said my pussy was scratching at the back door pussy scratch so long poor pussy got sore sore pussy sore pussy <laughs> you ain't never heard that song before yeah but i was singing it to them on instagram oh okay and I had played and we was in her key key and getting our jail. Poor pussy. Okay. Sore. Sore. <laughs> Wet. Wet. Hot. Hot. Cold. Ball. <laughs> Could I have um just a second? Okay, just let me know when you're ready. Okay. Where you at ordering? Oh, I'm going to get more cold. Oh, good water burger. Way to go, drag racing Thailand. I haven't had a water burger forever. I think it's amazing. Can I get a number one with tea? Number one with tea? Yes. And can I have the, um, I need the my mate on it also? To know to bring me M&M's. Uh, peanuts. Yes. Okay. A 
are bringing me the Reese's peanut butter, uh, and, Reese's uh, peanut butter cups, the one in two pack. I'm in love, though. Damn. Neither one of those had a peanut. I performed, oh, I performed a lot of Mariah Carey songs. <clears throat> but I like performing, can't take that away from me. They can say anything they want to say. Try to bring me down. Mm hmm. Don't have one in DC. Uh oh. Number one gonna come through. Number one two. Okay. <laughs> On the drive through window? Girl, yeah, it's on. My day is going great, love. How's your day going? Guess what, girl? What, Jill? Oh, guess what, Jill? I'm going home tomorrow, Jill. I got my package today, Jill. Oh, did you? Yeah, thank you, Jill. Whoa, ho, 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 day. Do they fit? I ain't trying to mind you. I've been asleep. Oh, that's smart. I know. I've been sleeping, working, Jill. Um, salt and pepper and, um, five kitchen. Okay. What'd you say? I've been working. Working and being asleep and shit. Bitch, how about my dress? I ain't even come out. Um, I'm going to have to leave some money for this woman to send my dress back when it do come. Where it come from? Miss Thames, I, I was supposed to wear it for the photo shoot today. Thank you. I was supposed to wear it for the photo shoot today. From, um, Jamie. You mailed it off? Oh, from Jamie. Uh-huh. John, uh, it ain't her fault. It was supposed to be his, been his Saturday. And the um, post office delayed the, delayed the van package. Look at that. You Look know who I'm doing in this? Mary J. Blige. I didn't, bro, I didn't buy them to do no damn Mary J. Blige. Bitch, I'm not that. I bought them so you can go on the block and be a hoe. Sister, it's raining out here. I can't hold in the rain. I got enough common sense now. <laughs> <laughs> I got common sense about to be a hoe in the rain. Ooh, and they fit like a glove. This is an eight, a nine think. and a half. I think. Yep. Mm-hmm, because that nine would have been fucking me up. And it go above my knee. And they sway. I'm gonna fuck up Mary. Real love. Just bust that up. Bam, bam, uh, uh. Yeah. I'm ready. To, okay. These are hot. Just you went in for these, girl. I knew to get these in a nine and a half. But get this shit off me. Shit. Her camera. Hey, how are you from who? I am from San Diego, California. Is where I'm from. But right now, I live in Corpus City, Los Angeles, California. I ran a tank top and some sweatpants. Unfortunately, okay, her phone call, I got this call. I am out in the back floor. It played so hard, poor pussy guy. Hot, hot, 
We were talking to them. Thank you so much. They gave me <laughs> Then pussy came back on. We heard sore pussy. Sore. I think what your daughter and you hung up on me. Uh, what daughter? I don't know. Oh, she at the room. I think she went out though. I didn't want to go out. Girls, wet outside is cold. I'm not on three thousand. Are you not there with you? No, they got her a room. Oh, she on the real book one. Well, yeah, cause she had rehearsal for the tour. Oh, okay. So they had booked her a room, not knowing that you know she could she could have came here. So I was like, "Bitch, go and get it. Just come over in the morning and cook me breakfast, bitch. No shade." So she, like right <clears throat> oh, she got a jail. Cause earlier she said, "Girl, I ain't gonna do nothing but go back to the room and dish and go to bed." Cause that's that's all she would do, girl, when she was here. She had days okay. lined up. That bitch going there dish and go to bed. I wake up like, "Girl, how was last night?" She was like, "Girl, I don't know. I went to sleep." Bitch, you always dishing it. Always dishing and going to sleep. I said, that must be a hateful dish to put you to sleep, Jeff. And relax the shit out of her. And she be out. So many times that bitch had dish and went to bed. I'm like, girl, <laughs> I can't tell you not to dish. Well, you trying to get some butt, you know, some dick in your butt. You don't want to put on a little doodle juice. <laughs> doodle clown on the body. My last, <coughs> my last of the most is gone. <laughs> right, so you got to keep it clean, right, right. Because you can't do that. You in school right now. You need to get your ass off here, baby. It's going to be my morning. ass. It's morning in the UK. I'm Virgo. Let's see those shit. I bought some, some of them little microwave little pasta thingies. I forgot who they buy, but one of them good brands. I'm going to throw them bitches up in the microwave. Add a little seasoning to it. Eat that little yeah, shit. I'm going um, go to order me some tires this week for my, um, for my bicycle. I want a bicycle too, Jid. I'm going to order me some. Um, all of my new times, bitch, so I can um get on my bike. Yes, Lord. Start back going to the gym. Yes, God. And get on my gym. Yes, Lord. God, I look so little in my picture today when I had my dress on. You looked at nice, Jeff. What you saw, Jeff? Oh, me and the picture of Scott Gerber. Yeah. Oh, bitch, the left. This ain't the woman's house. The woman's house right here. The lashes that the woman, um... Send me a nice girl. I said, look at Jess. She was ready for that photo shoot. I'm sorry I made that ugly face, but I have some. Marie Calder's fettuccine is bomb. I think that's who I got. She the green box, right? That's I'm who like, I think girl, I got. Go talk to your people. I'm going to go ahead and eat. Oh, that looks good, too, Jill. You should have got me a burger, Jill. Huh? You should have got me a burger. Yeah, you need a burger. <laughs> so disrespectful to me. Well, call me when you're done, because I'll be up. I'm just rhinestoning. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> 
a friendly little cat. Papa's cat was rocking in a rocking chair. He rocked so hard he lost, lost his, his hair. hair. Poor oh. pussy. <laughs> Sore. Wet. Wet. Hot. Hot. Tight. Bald. Pussy. Just a friendly little cat. Friendly little cat. My neighbor stole my kitty cat away from me. I told my neighbor, set my pussy cat free. Free pussy. <coughs> <coughs> She breaks it down. She gives it every type of. And she's talking about a pussy cat. But, you know, the way she's talking about it, pussy. Baby, the, the neighbor stole the pussy cat. Stole the pussy. So y'all just get a good laugh on that. That's something you could just play, you know, and just fall out every time. And it's a couple of versions, so you can get your dish or either or. Dance for you. By Beyonce? Baby, I can't play that right now because it's raining outside and I don't want to be going in all type of ways and stuff. And then I, you know, trying not to be a whole fuck piece. I'm trying to stay good until I find the right one. And, you know, 